Montessori method is really, first and foremost, it's a philosophy. It is a way of thinking. It has a pedagogical uh, base to it. Um, and it's very specific. It was founded by Dr. Maria Montessori. She was a physician in Italy and she basically approached learning and child development from a scientific perspective. And because Montessori, again, is a, a philosophy that respects humanity, that really believes that's, that people um, are on this earth to do good and to really um, contribute positively to society, not only do we need to prepare the environment physically, but we need to prepare the inner spiritual realm of the child as well. To be in a school is really, it's very important, but even more important for us than being in a school is making AYP, which is adequately yearly progress, which means that each subgroup is also making progress. Our goal here at the school is to make sure that we don't leave any groups behind. We don't leave the blacks behind, whites, Hispanics, the um, socially, economically disadvantaged, learning disabled. Our goal is that all subgroups make uh, AYP. So that's important. It's important to make the A, but it is important to make sure that all everyone is making the A. The role of a teacher in a Montessori environment is basically we're facilitators. We facilitate as far as helping the children find their interest and find their capacity, their potential, uh, guide them pretty much through the classroom, throughout the lessons. I'm a firm believer in getting the child involved in the whole process, not to just sit in a desk and receive the information from a teacher, to really um, incorporate the whole body, the exploration, and um, to just get involved in the experience of the, the process. The children already have the inborn potential to learn, and that children, uh, if given the appropriate environmental um, surroundings and are guided rather than mandated, they can flourish in a very holistic, organic way and their potential can really be tapped into and maximized. In the classroom, we want our environments around them to be safe. And so when they put down their lessons on the floor in little rugs, it condenses their lessons into an opportunity to be able to accomplish one thing after the next without having too much distraction. And so they're focused on what they're doing in front of them. And in this case, they're doing what's called the towers. In Montessori, we have um, 180 different lessons that are geared towards language, and they could be anywhere from homophones to antonyms to synonyms and other aspects of language le lessons themselves. They have chosen um, what they want to do, whether they're going to start with math or science or language, and, and there, there's a lesson going on right here, which is teacher-directed. She has chosen to work on language. They can choose to work at their table alone or choose to work with friends um, in a group, maybe on different things, but they're sitting together. The thing I like about my school is that we have freedom to move around, and it's something that you don't get in a lot of other schools. And there's three grades per class, so you get to experience with other kids other than just your grade. My son is only six years old, but he's already reading at a fourth grade level because he loves to read. And in the summer he read with me, I homeschooled him, and then he came here and all those Montessori ways of learning are very good for academics. I realmente creo en la filosofía Montessori y veo que mis hijos se han adaptado a esa filosofía, la han adoptado, son niños pues que escuchan, que obedecen, aprendieron a trabajar con libertad, pero al mismo tiempo a llevar un orden y saber que tienen que cumplir con todas sus responsabilidades. Having that reality and that venue to provide Montessori education, you know, to thousands of kids because we're now in our 13th year, we have served um, a couple of thousand children already. That makes me most proud, knowing that, that um, many of our former students come back to us and say that they look upon the years here at Bowie Montessori Academy as the best years of their life. Mm -hmm.